The overall goal of this procedure is to utilize a polyvinyl alcohol sponge to model wound healing in mice. This is accomplished by first hydrating and loading the sponge for implantation. Next, the sponge is inserted into a pocket between the abdominal muscle and the skin of the mouse. After implantation, each sponge can then be injected with a treatment. The final step is to remove the sponges from the mouse. Ultimately, sectioning, staining, and quantitative assays can be performed to observe changes and variations in the wound healing process. Though this method can provide insight into wound healing, it can also be applied to other areas of study, such as tumor angiogenesis, drug delivery, and implanted cell survival and engraftment. Begin by hydrating the sponges with overnight stirring in a 0.9% aqueous sodium chloride solution. Then autoclave 75 milliliters of the hydrated sponge suspension for 25 minutes at 121 degrees Celsius to sterilize the sponges. Place the autoclave sponge solution in a sterile hood and then use sterile tweezers to pick up one sponge. Squeeze the sponge with the tweezers and use a vacuum tip to remove as much solution as possible from the sponge. Now place the wrung out sponge in a tissue culture plate, being careful to leave space between sponges. Pipette the treatment solution directly onto the center of a sponge, then press down gently on the sponge with the pipette tip.